In today's video, I'm going to share with you a very powerful hair treatment. I have made a lot of research about this hair treatment and that's why I feel confident to come out and share with you this remedy to hair growth. According to Dr. Graf, rosemary oil can speed up the process of cell turnover and growth, which can work as a natural remedy to grow thicker hair. And according to Dr. Batra, rosemary oil is a natural remedy with data to support its role in decreasing hair loss and in promoting hair and scalp health. Hi guys! Welcome to my channel, this is Lean and Beauty. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and be sure to like this video as well. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell icon, that way you'll be notified every single time I upload a new video on my channel. So, in this video, like I already mentioned, I'm sharing with you a very powerful hair treatment. So today we are mainly doing rosemary hair oil. This is the best process of preparing rosemary hair oil. So I kindly ask you to watch this video to the end so that you're able to see every detail and see all the steps that you need to know or all the steps that you need to follow to prepare rosemary hair oil. So as you can see, I'm getting my rosemary ready and you know I'm adding water to the bowl but this is uh, salty water so I'm going to clean the rosemary so you just need to lightly rinse the rosemary to remove any debris and then after I'll try to dry the water off as you will see and then you will see the next steps as they follow so I would like to go more into the details of why you should go in for this hair treatment and why rosemary. So we're going to look at the benefits of rosemary, guys. Rosemary oil will help with hydrating your scalp and hair. And a hydrated scalp means that your scalp will be less itchy and flaky. So not only can it boost hair growth, but it also keeps your scalp healthy. And as we always say, healthy hair starts with a healthy scalp. So when your scalp is clean, healthy, of course you'll have healthy hair. So I'm done with plucking the rosemary from the stems. So I'm going to pound it a little bit to be able to uh, make sure that we get a lot of nutrients from the rosemary. Uh, and this makes the process much better so as we'll add in the oil the oil will be able to absorb most of the nutrients because we've already tried to pound the rosemary a little bit this is the measuring cup i'm using to measure the oil so i'm going to measure 250 ml of sunflower oil the cup is equivalent to 250 ml so about the career oil I'm using, of course I'm using sunflower oil, but you can use any other career oil of your choice. You can use grapeseed oil, you can use olive oil, you can use avocado oil, or any other career oil of your choice. So I'm going to add in the rosemary. So remember this is the pounded rosemary, so I'm adding it to the oil. After I'm going to get the bowl and make it sit in this boiling water. So I already added the water to the stove and it's already boiling. So I'll add the bowl to the boiling water. So this is the double boiler method. So I'm not cooking or preparing this oil directly to, uh, to heat. I'm mainly using the double boiler method. It's the best and it's much better to use this. So I'm going to let it heat for only 20 minutes and then turn off the flames. So don't exceed that. At least do it for 20 minutes. Trust me, you'll be able to get something good. So after 20 minutes, this is how our rosemary looks. This is it. As you can see, it's already turning. The oil has already turned green. So 
case this is our rosemary oil it's still having the rosemary in it and i'm going to let it stay overnight before i sieve it so guys the next day this is it as you can see the color gets even much darker it's so green as you're going to see so i'm preparing myself to sieve this and i'm going to use uh, a wig cap you can use a strainer you can use a cheesecloth you can use coffee filters but i'm using this so i'm going to strain it and you're going to be wowed by the results are you ready for this wow look at the color of the oil guys this is the rosemary hair oil just look at it look at that beautiful color just know the oil has you know absorbed all the nutrients from the rosemary this is the perfect way to make rosemary oil so guys with this method you're able to you know absorb all the nutrients you did not you know burn it so much you know it was just something simple you know only 20 minutes of using a double boiler method and you know you will get amazing results and you're able to gain a lot of benefits from such oil because it's properly prepared so guys thank you so much for watching if you're still watching please that means you're enjoying this video so go ahead and give me a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you've not yet subscribed don't forget to press the notification bell that way you will be able to get notifications every single time i upload any video on this channel where are you watching us from please go to the comment section and let us know where you're watching us from please we'd like to know where our viewers are watching us from so guys, these two bottles are all containing rosemary hair oil. So the first bottle is containing the rosemary hair oil we just made. And then it's uh, this other bottle is containing another kind of rosemary. I'll also share with you the video on how to make that kind of rosemary hair oil. Of course, I couldn't uh, you know, show it to you in this video because it would make that video very long. So I'd like to show you how best you can apply this rosemary hair oil to your hair and I'm going to use also rosemary water so I'm using rosemary water and rosemary hair oil I'll show you how to apply all of them to the hair so this is the rosemary water of course there is also a video I'm going to share with you on how to make rosemary water I already have another video but that is a different way how you can make it the other one is also different and this is our rosemary hair oil look at the green oh my god it's so nice so guys this is my hair it's in braids but i'm still going to apply the two treatments to the hair i'm going to apply rosemary water and then rosemary hair oil so i'll start by spraying the rosemary water to my hair and mainly the scalp so that's what i'm doing right now as i get myself ready to apply the rosemary hair oil to my scalp rosemary hair oil in rosemary water will help increase the growth of new hair by 50 percent when massaged onto the scalp it works by stimulating scalp circulation and can be used to grow hair longer it also prevents baldness or stimulates new hair growth in balding areas so rosemary hair oil will help with hydrating your scalp and a hydrated scalp means that your scalp will be less itchy and flaky so this is the best way to use rosemary for hair growth so as you've seen we've directly applied the rosemary water to our scalp and hair so that's the same thing we're going to do with our rosemary hair oil so uh, what i'm doing is massaging my scalp you need to massage your scalp to promote blood flow or blood circulation so that's what i did immediately after applying the rosemary water as you can see my hair really looks nice and healthy so i've been using most of these treatments and please don't forget to check out my videos on my youtube channel lean and beauty where you're watching from i guess so you need to check them out and see the kind of treatments i use please don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you've not yet subscribed and i would love to also know where you're watching us from so go to the comment section and let me know of the country 
or city where you're watching us from, I will be so happy to know that you're watching us from a given country. It makes us feel good and we're able to get encouraged to do more videos because we know the whole world is watching us. So I just finished applying some of the rosemary oil to my hair and scalp and I'm immediately massaging my scalp. So I'll go again and add some more oil as I keep massaging my scalp. You know massaging your scalp promotes blood flow or blood circulation. So guys you need to massage your scalp every time you use such kind of treatment. So I'll keep applying the rosemary hair oil to the rest of my hair and scalp as I keep massaging my hair. Don't forget the back, it's also very important. So I apply the oil and then go ahead to massage my scalp. So as you can see, my hair is really growing very fast and that's just one month and a half of use of having that uh, the braids on. And look at the growth, guys. Look at the undergrowth, it's really amazing. These hair treatments really work. Go ahead and check out our other videos and you'll see what I really use for my hair. If you've watched most of my videos in my treatments, I do take good care of my edges. So I give them some kind of special attention. So with this one, I just sprayed some uh, rosemary water to my edges and then applied the rosemary hair oil to my edges. And then I started massaging my edges as you can see. Please, if you have any questions about this video or hair treatment, go ahead and let us know through the comment section. And don't forget to mention the country where you're watching us from. Please, you can as well let us know if you enjoyed this video or if you have any other video ideas that you would like us to uh, record for you. So please, guys, that's all I had for you. I've mainly used rosemary water and rosemary oil. And please, I'm going to share with you more videos about rosemary. I'm going to share a video on how to make rosemary water in a very unique and special way. So you better subscribe to this channel if you haven't yet subscribed. And please press the notification bell so that you're always the first person to know every single time I upload my videos, guys. Thank you so much for watching. May God bless you. And I'll be happy to see you in my next video, guys. We post our videos every week on Tuesday. So please don't forget to tune in. Thanks a lot and bye-bye.